That's all of Dwarf Fortress, Joe. That is the game. Detailed I mean, you can, clutch, you can throw game. 40 different militia at, like, a forgotten beast. Ah, stuff dies, whatever, but with that thing, if one of them, you get these, you get, they wind up with sleepers. It's ridiculous. Well, yes. welcome to Joe Teaches Al Dwarf Fortress, everybody. I'm Joe. I'm Al. We've just gotten done fighting off a were-rabbit. Literally the curse of the were-rabbit. That's if, really actually if, kind of funny. If that episode is not named Curse of the Were-Rabbit, Joe, I will be personally upset. No, I can't name it that. No, I will be... <laughs> <laughs> the, the irony is... It's not really irony, but anybody listening to this already knows what it was yes. named. I don't, because we're recording this ahead of time. Freakishly ironic. You guys have all of the knowledge. I don't have any knowledge. Why are you guys cooking stuff? Um, should we designate some bedrooms while we're on this level? <laughs> have I not done that? It doesn't... I've done that. Oh, are they? Okay, yeah. okay. They're not messy, but they're there. Yeah, I, I can't tell when they're all empty and nobody's thrown their clothes on the floor. <laughs> we should... Isn't that always the way? <laughs> um, I was debating... What am I doing? You were debating. Uh, making some rooms for the inn. Maybe throw that in there. Nothing okay. As lavish as I was my thinking that the, the rooms for the inn should be on a different level. Okay, we can do that too. I don't know exactly which level, but I was thinking something, while not outlandishly difficult, a little bit special. I was going to sort of... I, I had debated throwing them in just haphazardly at one point in the Let's Play, just randomly throwing some magic bedroom somewhere and not really telling you what was going on and then chuckling. Well, I, I, I mean, I wouldn't have been like they're sleeping in places, but I don't like I don't understand how that would have been. Uh, it's like you set up a room <laughs> a server that's different than. The <laughs> <laughs> it's really inside baseball jokes here, Joe. <laughs> a while ago, we used to do let's so plays on ago. tabletop simulator, and every time someone would be in charge of setting up the server, name it Human Echo Server, and have the game all ready to go. Al had this great idea for a joke once where I was setting up the server and he uh, set up a different server with the same name it was expecting hilarious. Tony to go in <laughs> <laughs> not know which <laughs> server was which get into the game and be like what? it would have just... been great if he had fallen for it okay he didn't fall for <laughs> it and it fell flat but I still last a lot at the for, idea. It really, I, that's the thing. Great is a bit of a stretch there. He just would have been like, what's going on? And then I would have been like, are you on the right server? <laughs> and you, it was, be honest? It's like Parcheesi or something, though. <laughs> yeah. It's a completely different game. Uh-huh, uh-huh. It's wild stuff. You don't understand comedy, Joe. I understand. <laughs> also, I think your giggling would have probably clued us in, too. <laughs> Wow, I'm giggling getting... all the time. I'm giggling right now about <laughs> Independence Day, the trailer. <laughs> Not Independence Day, Independence yes, Day from the Asylum. The uh, day of independent people who are plural. Just how long until they get sued for that? Uh, probably like a week, but I can just <laughs> love it for as the, the, the movie. I told Sony the movie's not coming out in that under that name. Like it'll no be way. alien attack or something dumb. Yes. But agreed. I love it so much that they were like they I it, it amazes me that they have things like that and yet their social media presence is basically non-existent. I don't yeah, understand how that company isn't like they 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 get their bread and butter on social, you know, sort of social media, but they don't do anything with it. It's a very odd a, a conundrum. Ooh. What's happening? What's happening? I'm channeling out those last bits and the, the water is the standing falling water in. is falling into the yeah. Oh, okay, I got you. Hopefully none of that is dwarf smoke. Is, a thing. <laughs> I is that a this, thing? Yeah, I mentioned this a couple of let's plays ago. I, something else happened in the middle of it. I asked you if you've ever seen a dwarf fall into the lava, and you said no, which is sad because you get dwarf smoke and it's really a th astounding thing I, I mean i'm gonna channel this out right isn't this the the end goal here well yeah w one of the things we don't know what's gonna happen <laughs> yes okay so we want to channel out uh a wall and then eventually replace that wall with windows right mm, 
Yes. I've done that right. Yes, but I think I need to channel out one in, not this one. No, you're right. Well, no, because it's just filling right back in. It should fill in with... Isn't the water going to fall down and turn that into stone? It did already. That was phase one. Oh, I got you. Okay. I think. As much as we have this planned out. <laughs> that was phase one. Let's see what well, cancel that other channel. I did. Okay. We're all fine here now. Thank you. Okay. My question is, once we're down here... And we channel out one of these, what happens? Like when we channel out, you know, this or something. First, I gotta channel this out. Apparently, that one didn't take either. That's a mine. Good. And just for fun, let's. The whole loop. Maybe we'll drop something in the. <laughs> accidentally killing hundreds of dwarves. Do that. Yeah, don't do the whole loop yet. Do Check. most Got of it. the loop and then do like one final thing that maybe somebody won't be, they won't all be standing there. So walking around in, uh, oh, look. What am I looking at? Ton, er, uh, militia captain. Is there something going on with our food? Cancels. Oh, no, he's our cook, too. That's the guy who's locked in a room. Oh. <laughs> he oh, can't get food because there's no food available. That's not um our chef chef guy, is it? No, Wolfgang Puck is our chef chef guy. Yeah, I couldn't, Ton, I couldn't think of the famous chef name. I'm sorry. Ton is apparently is also a cook. I guess we're taking him off that now. He ain't doing no cooking no more. Yep. Ain't gonna cook no cook. more no more. I ain't gonna cook no more. So that goes. He wasn't very good for be, being only a cook, even a secondary one. Yeah. He didn't have any other labors. How does he, I'm kind of glad he turned into a werebeast. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's how I... Oh, no! Okay. These guys are kind of making me nervous. Standing right there on top of the thing that they're mining? Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Although, again, you might get to see dwarf smoke. They, they haven't oh, heard of seven because OSHA it's, oh, it's interesting. in this dwarf land. No, they have not. What is this guy doing? He's just kind of hanging out. Hanging out. Hanging out. Monum Hanging boat lances. Out. Hanging out with the family. General. Having He's ourselves a party. <laughs> what? <laughs> Look at his job. I got, what? I was thinking hanging out. <laughs> fish? <laughs> Are there fish in this water? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> but he's like, oh, all right, it's time to fish. And he just comes running down here to fish. Dumbass. Maybe there are fish. I also wonder if there's a... Uh, if these guys are getting swimming skill. I would find that interesting. Gotta be a little bit, right? I don't know. I, I, don't, I don't know how that works. I only know about swimming in, like, the adventure mode stuff. How does that work? Uh, Wait, what are you doing? I thought we were going to try to drop the, the floor well, in. Well, we're trying to do what? Drop the floor in. The thing is, it's uh, so narrow that it's sevens down there. Oh, you actually wanted to drop the floor in? Yeah. Isn't oh. that the point? Aren't we... Oh, no, no, no. We need to dig down into... You really lost the plot here, haven't you? I have kind of, yeah. <laughs> going to channel this out one layer down to here. So right. that we'll be standing... On this bedrock, on this obsidian. Yes. And then we channel one more layer down, and hopefully the lava doesn't come bubbling back up. And then we build our glass windows. Yes. And glass floor. Which, ideally, we're actually doing. Oh, maybe they are doing it. Huh, how about that? You didn't check the still last time, by the way. I did this time, though. Oh, okay. This one I did. I didn't and see you do that. I'm sorry. I agree. Uh, I think I tried to get your attention, but you were singing or something. Because you were correct. Stodir Fathukutut. Is that the guy who's in the... I hope so. <laughs> also, do I have a graveyard? Uh, yeah. Do you remember where it is by any chance? It's up there on our main level. Right there. to the le Down to the left. Right across oh, from the hospital. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We had the whole thing where we talked about how the yes. people in the hospital could look across the way and see yes, the <laughs> eventual plight. Yes. Also, there is a well in one of those beds. That's fine. It's a bucket. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Probably gonna have to expand the old graveyard. 
You can just build more stones, headstones on top of each other. There's like tons of room for more headstones. I don't want it to just be like a warehouse full of headstones. I want. I love that. I love that idea of like just like the clustered together graveyard. Oh, where... oh my god! Did you see that? What? No. This announcement. There's nothing to catch in the central magma sea. So those guys fishing down there didn't find anything, and. uh... He was actually fishing in the magma sea? I guess so. Or that's what that's labeled now. That's what they named that. That's pretty neat. Hanging out. I wish these guys would turn so they stopped being freaking hungry. That's what I was saying. We're going to get announcement spam from those people. And the, yeah, annoying. you're right. For the first week. But once they turn, all the, the uh, hunger and thirst resets. Yeah, but then, like, it doesn't take that long to get hungry and thirsty again. And they only turn yeah. once a month, Joe. I... Don't you take that tone with me, Albert. <laughs> <laughs> I've had were people trapped in my caverns before. It works out. Okay. But this first time around, it is definitely a thing. Do, 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 do. I'm looking to see if there's a uh, lava fishing. If they can fish in the lava. I'm going to Google it because it's not in the wiki that I can find. That'd be pretty amazing. Not gonna lie, I would like that. I think I threw a bunch of people onto mining during the great <laughs> chaos. Yeah, you don't need to be on mining. Uh, I'll keep you on. You oh, the dwarves fish with their bare hands. What? Apparently, they don't have fishing gear. That's interesting. That's pretty badass. Well done, dwarves. Charlie Work cancels dig lost pick. You're an idiot. Where did the pick go? There goes the fisherman. <laughs> uh, someone also answered, remember uh, way back, this wall wouldn't get built? Right. Someone pointed out that the stone we designated to build that with was out on the island that we couldn't get to. Um, you have to be kidding me. I, I do? What? Uh, go to metals. Okay. Uh, what are the ores that turn into what metals? Uh, which me which ore hematite, specifically? Hematite, hematite, hematite. Uh, it's an ore of iron. <sighs> Why? So I just struck it. Where? Over here, in the, uh, graveyard. <laughs> <sighs> so we've had iron this entire time. <laughs> well, didn't we say that a couple episodes back, where we were like, well... We're probably going to find it just sitting around somewhere. Yeah, I think we did. Pretty sure we did. Yeah, that's the thing that happened. Is there auto mining in this? I forget if that's a, a DF hack thing or if it's a... Uh... Yeah, no, that, there's auto mining in this. However, okay. what is Michelangelo doing? Nothing. Oh, wait, no. Go back. Oh, wait. <laughs> Not all the there. way back. Yeah. Oh, God, how did he get here? What is he doing down there? I told you not to put him down there. I didn't put him down You're there. Remember I told you not to put him in the sea? <laughs> He's down here in the magma sea. Or uh, not the magma what sea. What is happening? Why is he down here? What is his task? No job. You have a job. Stop swimming in the cavern of... Uh, why? I don't know. He shouldn't. He shouldn't be collecting wool. I don't know. I have no idea. What is... How on earth... Okay, I guess he fell in somehow? What would he even be doing down here? I don't know. What is this guy doing? There's Zazit Cloudplank. Unreachable location. What are these idiots doing? They're falling in. I hate dwarfs so much. How many z -lo I can't tell where they are in relation to, like... Is that a z level down? Here's the cavern. We can actually see Zazit. Right. I mean, I'm sorry, here's the uh, entrance. Michelangelo is... here. Alright, let's... How did he get Michelangelo. I Maybe chased by whoa, something? Whoa, 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 whoa. Are you gonna dig in? Is that water at that level? I'm just gonna dig stairs-ish, but yeah. Water's at this level. I mean, he, is he drowning? I think he's swimming. What? Oh, because I'm auto mining. Good lord, I'm doing. We're gonna get over. It's okay, Michelangelo. We're not gonna let that water into. Probably. We don't want to do that, Joe. 
This is what I'm, probably. This is my point is, I would rather <laughs> I not have to deal with another flooding situation. This is open space. You're above the water here. Okay. We are going to have to build floors and stuff. <sighs> okay. Michelangelo, let's just double check. Here he is. He does not have any of the wool gathering stuff. Is there some sort of... Was you he have... trying to haul food water hauling? Why is he on hauling at all? He's Michelangelo. He shouldn't have hauling okay, that's on. That's fair enough. He, he came along pretty early on in the uh, in the Ford. That's fair enough. Whoops. If we lose uh, Michelangelo, I'm going to be a little bit sad. A little bit? This is the one dwarf we said we would be sad about, if you recall, a long time ago. Uh, I maybe do I recall well. a long time ago. <laughs> maybe a well is the problem, sort of. That wouldn't be a bad idea now that we have this. Uh, is there like a Z level up to this that works? What? I mean, is there a point in our fort that's close enough to where... I'm digging one, is... and then I'm going to build one, and then we're going to build a well. That's how that's going. Okay. <sighs> Alright, is that... I think he climbed a tree. What's, uh, what he's what's doing? the, he's sitting down what's here the miasma? Down. What's this purple stuff over here? Uh, it's something dead. Is it Michelangelo dead? No, Michelangelo's here. He's in this okay. tree. He's just hanging out in this tree. Hanging out. Hanging out. I don't know. Finding the source of miasma is kind of tricky sometimes. Because because there's miasma. I have I have asthma. My asthma. And mine not too. Your, not, no. My asthma. You know what? I don't He's gonna get soul. hit by it. It's gonna like come to him and like overwhelm him, and he will die. Well, aren't you? Whoa! That's maybe not what we need to do at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> you and your thoughts. I understand you're trying to make it go faster. <laughs> Come on. What are those red things? I assume there's some kind of a under underground uh, plant life. This is a goblin cap. Okay. Yes, underground. And the plant white life. ones are. I actually learned something interesting. That's a tower cap. Michelangelo is in a thick spore tree, and the purple ones. I thought maybe they're pink in this. Purple, pink, kind of the Tunnel same. Tube. No, nope, there are no purple ones. That's interesting. Purple trees down here are called nether cap, and they are actually not. They are magma resistant. Oh yeah. Yeah. So you can build quote unquote wooden structures that won't uh, burn up in magma. Correct. By the way, we mentioned in the previous episode that uh, having our cattle grazing in our uh, arboretum was not great for our trees. It's great for the cattle. Do you want to maybe put them somewhere else or d restrict them to only one part of the arboretum? I've got a lot going on right now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really focused on Michelangelo and sort of focused on getting this dug out. Like a dugout canoe? Yes. Boy, do I want a dugout canoe. <laughs> when I was growing up, I never got to have a dugout canoe. No. Not like a dugout canoe. Okay. That uh, that one little channel over there that's on its own is really making me nervous. Hi. Dwarves always work their way through in a logical manner. <laughs> <sighs> The reason this is so stressful for me is because normally I'm drinking when I do this, which makes things much easier. Well, nobody said you couldn't be drinking. <laughs> I'm joking. That's usually where the most god-awful mistakes come from. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, so we might get more it. entertainment out of that. It would be interesting, but the, my uh, focus on actually speaking about what I'm doing, it becomes much more muttery. Oh, okay. I got you. And I just sit, sit in silence and think, I don't know how to find... I gotta go here to find Michelangelo again. I don't, it I mean, does... I don't have to, but... Oh no. Oh wait, no. That's the. I thought it was gone already. Oh, we'd lost him. Designate that, designating that as a one does not seem to have really sped things up that much. Because we have this crappy minor 
who I designated as a we have a newbie miner on it. Yep. I just got some cats. Just gave birth. Well, he's getting better as he mines. Yeah. Hematite is also a month of the uh, year on the dwarf, or, dwarf calendar. Oh, interesting. Just as a little uh, bit of trivia to throw out there for you guys. I'm really curious if he's going to be able to walk through the tree to get to this eventual thing we're going to build. You got to build. You got to put down floors, right? Yeah, I mean, I could go around. I don't know which is faster with this idiot. I think... Well, he'll probably leave, and yes, then you could redesignate good... with a one, and maybe somebody better would come back. That is correct. So I would say go around. I would say go. Uh, you can't see what I'm doing. What I'm doing with my mouse. Uh, <laughs> just make one kind of loop thing around uh, the water here. Well, he'll uh, he'll leave once he hits the edge. Once he has I... no more left to mine in his grasp, he'll leave. I understand that. Yes, Albert, go on. Sorry. I'm just saying, once he leaves, then we make a loop around. Oh, then we make a loop around. And forget about, like, the middle pieces. All right. Whoops. I was just... Are you gonna... I'm not sure what I'm doing. Shut okay. Up. Here's your loop around. That's what I was thinking. Now there's a uh, a diagonal there. Will they be cool with that? Yeah, they're cool with diagonals. Okay. It's, it's, it's I, I, yep, I see that. I'm Maybe. not. That looks weird to me, but yes, they are cool with diagonals. Okay. Any uh, second now, somebody who's really good at mining is going to show up here. Oh, yeah. Just you wait. If this guy doesn't grab a stone, we're... Here he comes. Here he comes. It's gotta be like a two yeah. Oh, no. We got it. <laughs> <laughs> We're all the way to the. End. <laughs> well, we didn't want him because he's not a little miner. He's oh, a plant. Not... He's a gatherer, and he'd be bad at mining. See, here's a uh, miner. Okay. Watch this guy goes. Be like knife through butter. That one's a little better. That's choo -choo -choo. this is much better. Not exactly the kind of butter that I have in my house, but okay. Really? You don't have stone butter? Yeah. This mm. is. Go, 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 go. I was thinking the other day how, um, why did he stop? Like, he's thinking about stuff. He's having a sandwich. Michelangelo is not happy. Yeah, I, you think? I don't oh. know what he's doing down there initially. <laughs> he had to have been going to get water. I mean, that's my only, that's my best guess. This guy's drinking. Man. Remember when you said we should check the stills? <laughs> yes. Oh God. That's yes, good to do, do for a lot of reasons. That causes a lot of chaos. Go, go, go. Come on. Oh, my God. Get him out of there. I don't even know if this is going to do it. You could chop down the tree. That's Get not. him a stepladder. No, no, you could, you can mine out. Oh, we're saving, Joe. <laughs> da, you, da, can, da. you can mine out the piece above there as well. You can mine out the piece above there as well. No, what? I can't, because the, the one to the north, in case the... Well, no, the tree trunk isn't in the way, right? I have no idea. I've never had... Because they can do diagonal. Shockingly, I've never encountered this situation before, somehow. In adventure mode, I you think you would be able to uh, get through there. Okay. That would be nice. Although, it's weird. Like, you can climb up trees in adventure mode, and it's... Like, moving around in trees is very odd. I've gotten to many points where... I'm just like, I don't know what I'm doing. I just jump out, <laughs> like hurl myself I'm out. so excited for Adventure Mode. <laughs> I don't know if I mentioned that yet. Oh, it pauses after save. Okay. That's great. Yes! Woohoo! Woo! And up here, uh, build construction floor. Do I have blocks? I have some blocks. Excellent. Put a well in here and then never think about it again. Are you just going to put a well all the way down there? Sure. Why? Because I don't care. Because I have other things to do. I have to build the library and build the inn. Okay. This is also just leaving my fort wide open to anything that, any flyers that come in here. But you know what? Fath Al Rob has grown to become a, a male peacock. No food available. 
How much? How long have we been getting those? A while. It's possible he's not a werewolf. <laughs> Holy Christmas! Okay. Vile forces of du- force of darkness has arrived. <sighs> Man. <laughs> What do we got? Well, at least we got Michelangelo out of there. We've got some goblin invaders. Oh, goblins aren't too bad, right? Nah. I mean, we'll probably lose some people, but they're if they'll, they'll just die or get injured. Yes, they won't. Uh, man, what am I they, doing? Alerts. That's what I wanted. Oh crap! We've never actually used the. Do we even have a bridge built yet? <laughs> No, we don't. <laughs> <laughs> really? And I could have sworn I built a bridge. Oh, you know what's nice too? What? We have those uh, cages. Man, I keep doing things wrong. Maybe they'll get caught in the cages. That'd it be just nice. so happens that it's vomit patrol time. So we actually have our military stationed by our entrance. Meaning you forgot in the last episode and they've been standing out there for months. Well, they stand out there every three months at a time. Oh, okay. That's I thought you meant their, uh, you stationed him out there for the werewolf thing. No, 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 no. I have a bridge. It's right Where's here. Where's that? It's, it's oh, one, I can one, see One it. by one bridge. All right, we'll pull the lever. I, don't, I have no idea what lever it is. Pull the lever! Is there a lever? It's probably on this floor. If there's, Yeah, that looks like the lever. Problem with one by one bridges is that it's really hard to tell when they're up. Well, the cat just walked through there, so I think it's up. We also have this other entrance to our fort down here. Yeah, which isn't that kind of the point. Yeah, but I haven't, said, I haven't actually done that correctly yet. Well, you're going to have somebody pull the lever and some dwarves are going to go flying because they're standing on those walls. Ideally. Ideally. There we there go. There it goes. Are they up? There's the fish. That dwarf is still standing on the wall. So I think I got half of them, half of them done. Those... Well, what happened? <laughs> how did we not do this? I don't understand how we're so woefully unprepared. Holy crap. They have some beak dogs. Have you seen the big invasion yet? What the heck? Yeah, we need to not be on vomit patrol. We I think need- that's too late. They're already engaged down here. Okay. They're, they're doing their best. Uh, what we need to do... I kind of wish we had those crushing walls back. Well, we got half of this done, but not all of it. We're bringing the uh, constructive practice up here. We do have a bottleneck, so that's good. Right, but we don't have any traps in that bottleneck. We don't have... What was the point here exactly again? I don't do that. We're just going to walk back and forth and get into our fort. <laughs> but it'll be It's going to take them slightly longer. <laughs> We're going to station these guys here. It's going to take them a long time. We'll have a bottleneck and we'll build some traps. I don't know which bridges are up or down, though. Did you link up all the bridges? Well, some of them are. See this guy having to wind his way around? I don't know where he's going. He's probably going to pick up a... He has no job. I don't know what he's doing. He's just going out to see what's going on with them goblins. He's like, oh, man, goblin invasion. He's picking up a stone? Nope, they're just wandering around. Didn't you station the people not in here? I Maybe. Is this Why part is of your <laughs> burrow... <laughs> How do you do burrows again? Let's see. Oh, crap. Maybe you should put... Oh, there it is. Great. Let's make sure that's not... How do I... Uh... <sighs> Define this burrow. Hmm. Currently painting. No, we don't want to paint. We want to race. Ah. See how I did that? R. In the I burrow. see that. I've learned something. Joe taught, Joe taught Al something in this Let's Play. <laughs> it's amazing. So now we can get at least a sense. The here comes this cat. All right. So the traps. Oh, no, I want to pull up. No, I want to do this. Man, this is gonna be so good. <laughs> Man, this is gonna be what awesome. a great defense. <laughs> it works. I'm glad we didn't leave those other walls there where they could get squashed with just the pull of a lever. Yeah, well, they were gonna get flooded at one point, but then I never got around to building that. Mm, 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 mm. I wonder how they're only down to they're only down to uh, these guys are putting up a fight they're only down to six holy cow oh we're doing good 
Doing good? These guys rocked it. They took out the entire goblin army. Oh, yeah, that's good, right? That's not bad. I would say it's above and beyond good. Amazing. Wonderful. Yes. Stupendous. The point where we're actually going to have these guys go out and kill the rest of the goblin army. If I can find them. They're gone. They're all dead. It's over. <laughs> In the moments that we were talking, they finished them off. <laughs> yes. During the moments of panic, they managed to kill everyone. That's impressive. That's really impressive. What level... Are, first of all, how injured are they? We lost six of them. Out of ten? That's disappointing. Or out of seven. Only I don't... I think they were full. Um, you can get ten in, in a squad, right? Yes, you can get ten in a squad. Well, the four that are left should be battle-hardened. Maybe we're down to six. Also, I'm noticing there's holes in the... In the uh, I suck at this game. There's holes in the ground here. I don't know if a tree uprooted or something. It doesn't go down to our fort, though, right? Yeah, it goes right into our fort. Oh, well. <laughs> we should fill what those in. What is happening? <laughs> this game gets really, uh, really you complicated. Know what else has been going on? This is interesting. Also, you should I'm take dead. off the burrow. <laughs> So we haven't have had a manager, manager or a bookkeeper in a quite a while. This this is like this is where we are you. not good at having multiple balls in the air. That's what this game is all about. We're really good at like focusing on getting one person out of a tree. Yeah, for forty that. minutes. Remember, remember that guy was in the tree. <laughs> Our glassmaker's getting pretty good, huh? Huh? Go glassmaker! All right, Eton Barmerk Reserger. You're our new guy. Your nickname is going to be... Why did I make nickname that guy Chowder? Right. Uh, anyway. I don't know. <laughs> your nickname is going to be what? Who, me? The new n manager. The manager? Uh, let's Fine. call him... Alberto. Doy. Alberto. I like that. <laughs> Nailed it. <laughs> Search Alberto. Oh, you're also our broker. Well, one of you is. Yeah, Albert Berg is a broker. Albert Toy is like the man who <laughs> aspires to be me. <laughs> All right, quick little tip here. Tell with about my amazing wheeling and dealing. With DF hack. <laughs> so here we have our office for our manager, but our manager is dead. When you assign this, if you, whoops, assign that to Albert Toy. Then this thing pops up down here in DF Hack. You can make this not just to Alberto. You can actually just have the manager have this auto allocate. Yes, auto allocate. Not, I mean, for the manager, whatever. For the mayor, that's huge because the mayor switches around a lot and he needs a bedroom or whatever. I mean, technically, if you're playing the game well. Um, not that we would know anything about that. No, no, we don't know anything about that. But. Uh, you know, you can just make a bedroom the mayor's bedroom instead of a specific mayor's bedroom, and it's a it's a big time saver. Also, having a ridiculous military uh, that was a no. Let's yeah, let's see how they are looking now. So it's creative leaps. They've leveled up a little bit. Twenty kills, eighteen kills, sixteen kills. This guy is Sodor is or what? Who's that? I don't know. Stodor, the guy with zero kills. He is not pulling his weight. Yeah, what's up with that, Stodor? All right, maybe I'll start to fill them out. Somehow he's not got gained any... Well, he's gotten better, right? A little bit. Hey, it's up to like seven or eight. He just probably was locked inside or something. Well, he must have been in combat to get... Well, maybe they were just training. Oh, yeah. No, they've been going up. Oh, I need a new uh, boss for this. Hmm. Paul Bunyan. What is happening? Paul Bunyan's our woodchopper, right? I guess. Did we get a new wave? Okay, no. These are all... What's this guy? A soap maker. When did he sneak in? Shall that work? Okay. I need a new... Uh, he's listening to music. I need a new military leader for that squad. And don't I want to... Can I promote someone? Hey! All right. Good chunk. Uh, let's save real quick. You're making me nervous now. Jamaican, you nervous? We did save the game in between, which we well, almost at some point never in there, We had a spring save. 
And now I can't do anything because this is... Just wait. It'll be okay. Hopefully it'll be okay. <laughs> Decent chance it'll be okay. All right. Zooming out. Zooming out. Zooming out from the door fort. Nailed it. Having ourselves I a want party. Doran Asobal to be the military leader. Can I? Who can that? tell that I've just seen Birdemic? Anybody well, who's the leader seen Birdemic can tell. Or an Asobal. Only good part of that movie. The musical. The music. The musical number that they just drop in, where it's like you can tell it's like a local dude that they you know got to like we're making a movie. You want to sing your song in it? And the guy's like, yeah, whatever, man. <laughs> whatever you know for exposure but it's like something that somebody actually worked on and, and tried to do well even if it's not the best song in the world compared to everything else in that movie that's just slapped together rubbish <laughs> <laughs> I love that um alright filling out the squad with whatever I don't care you go to the squad you're in good hands State Farm that's them, right? Or all state? Yes. Ton? Here. No, I should not put Ton on the squad. That's something I should not do. Who's Ton? The guy locked in a room who we think is a werewolf. Oh yeah, but hasn't turned yet. Uh, I don't. Um, I have somebody to choose from. Who's this guy? I have all these haulers. I don't know what this is sorting by at the moment. You go in there. Commit. Okay. What was I doing? <laughs> and that's the uh, name of this episode. No, the Building name of this a episode lava is... Lover library, Joe. I oh, know, that's not the name of this episode. I demand it. I'm trying to build a... Whoa! No, I'm just lost. Where's our well area? I don't know, Joe. <laughs> well, I used to find it by finding Mike. There it is. Has anyone... No one's built this stupid stuff yet. Construction Constructed suspended. and acted. <sighs> How much do you love jo dwarfs, Joe? <laughs> oh my God, that, what is that? There's a guy down there by that tree thing. Who's it's that? The Reacher. What? Oh, this guy? I don't know. It's just some nobody. Are you sure? It's Zazit Lunchem. Yeah, it's one of our... Well, I guess he's a fighter, so... This is a Reacher. What's a is Reacher? He, they're dangerous. They grab people and pull them into the water. It's possibly part of the problem. Well, what can we do about that? Well, we're gonna wall. We're gonna build this floor out and build our well. Wall off the well, and hopefully he can't reach up through a well and grab it. Meanwhile, that's just the price we have to pay for our silk trade. Yeah. <laughs> this is. Uh, oh, are people just now. getting stuck in here? I think so. I don't know. I think reachers are pulling people in. <sighs> this is not great. This is uh... <laughs> oh, now he's coming up. Ah! Now he's ours, Mister Reacher. <laughs> Jack Reacher. Jack Reacher. Well, then they'll, then he'll jump back in the water and like our guys. Reach this. Hopefully. Yep. There he goes. Boop, 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 boop. We don't have any crossbow militia, which seems like it would be the best type of militia to have. Whatever. Our hammer dwarfs crushed. Crushed. Yeah, but they can't get to army. guys who aren't next to them. Look, Michelangelo is back. Doesn't matter. They brought bowmen and we still destroyed them. Yeah, but like a, cro a crossbow uh, militia can attack from behind a... Uh... What I'm is that saying... thing? What? Just like a thing that keeps popping up by the in the water. A fish. Oh, okay. It, it never popped up long enough for me to really tell. And there they're like our army, our army attempting to find this reacher. Morons. <laughs> That's actually a really cool. I don't know what he looks like exactly, but I'm just imagining kind of a golem esque sort of blind cave fish thing, like really long, thin, lanky arms, like. Pretty sure it's Gollum related. I would look it up if I were you. I will. I just want to make a horror movie about it. They're finally going to make a Slenderman horror movie. Did you hear about that? I did not. You're I don't know how that's for taken forever to find to get in development. It's the e the only thing I could think of 
with that was that like because it's such a weirdly uh like it's it's something sort of collectively owned by yeah, everybody on the that. internet that they didn't know who to ask you know to buy the rights off of cuz there was the guy originally who drew the picture but he didn't like a lot of the mythology has sort of been built up by a lot of people yeah i could see that being the case evil humanoids with gray skin and black eyes not intelligent black eyes as eyes all like evil a doll's eyes creatures they cannot be tamed by dwarves not be tamed by dwarves. Were they do not that? act like their pres- description says yet. Oh, so it doesn't actually drag people into the water to strangle well, that's them. That's stupid. Here, there's one down here. It's causing some problems. Guys, killed this creep. No, wait, no, killed the. Where is he? I just still love that idea. The guy, like a humanoid monster that lives in the water, but like is all long and lanky and. Like white pasty skin with oh I want to I want to see that that's been done before somewhere hasn't it not just Gollum I th- I've seen that and I can see that in my head so clearly I feel like it sort of has there's to the be. cave things from um, what was the name of that movie The Descent yeah I didn't see that but they don't live in the water our guy just beat up the preacher it kind of like Abe Sapien but m- like l- weirder and. Like, maybe they can't even really easily come out of the water, or if they do, they look really bizarre and weird. I have to ask, what is Cave Sapien? Abe Sapien. What is Abe Sapien? From Hellboy. What? Is he in Hellboy? The, uh, water guy? Yeah. Oh, he's, like, demure and cool and, like, nice. I'm saying his look, though. Like, no, he, his if he took away the long, blue skin, I'm, I'm just using him as a starting point, okay? Terrible. Terrible starting point. Well, I'm sorry. Here's our well now. <laughs> ah. And that'll do it for us in this episode of Dwarf Fortress. Really? We are at 44 minutes on my account. I got nothing done! <laughs> there, I can't do anything about that, Joe. <laughs> I don't understand. Where does the time go? No, we have to try and channel out one of these things. All right. To see if the library even is remotely doable in concept. Okay. So I'm gonna I'm gonna do this. So four, good, fine. Get this up here. That's not at all what I wanted. It's cool. It's cool. It's cool. Oh my god! What are you doing? This up here. We just need the water to spread out far enough so that we can get someone down there to channel out a block, and then we'll see what happens. Sort of, because with the water and magma, we're not actually gonna know what happens, but that's okay. It's okay if we if nothing actually gets accomplished. <sighs> it's a game, Joe. I'm still te- I'm still tense from that where thing. Which that was apparently the last episode. <laughs> I know, apparently, we've just got two guys locked in. Well, the- for everybody listening, that was an entire week ago. <laughs> <laughs> they're just locked in this room. I don't think they're turning. <laughs> <laughs> they're not That's- dying. No, they're not dying. Well, it takes them all to die. Um, but it's been well. No, it's still granite. If it gets to slate, if it gets to fell site, we'll know for sure. <laughs> <laughs> That's when we'll know. I love the idea that you just like lock some people in a room for no oh, yeah. reason. That's <laughs> <laughs> really quite. It's quite fun. Has there mm-hmm. ever been like a zombie movie that did that, where somebody got shot in the head accidentally and they I weren't actually bitten? I feel like there's tons of different movies where various quote unquote monsters have accidentally been shut away. All right, well, so that guy's walking around down there. I guess it's. All right. He's, he's an idiot, or. Well, there's a ramp. Let's not rule out him being an idiot. All right, let's see if we can channel this square. It's not flashing. Where is. Wait, Samuel Adams is now doing something. I know I said we're going to do this, but whatever. He's just hanging out there. Okay, Samuel Adams, you're unable to give water because there's no water source. They are waiting for you to finish the well? Did the well get finished? Yeah, there's a well. There's a dead guy in a tree. <laughs> I don't, the well is inactive. Needs architecture. They saw that creepy, like, guy in the water and... Well... And a, what? <sighs> I don't know. I truly don't know this time. I have no idea. All his hauling was off. There's just a giant bat down here. This guy's down here too. He's hanging out. Good old that guy. Swimming around. 
having a freak out apparently <sighs> this is great finish the we- well <laughs> you idiots this guy's fighting a giant bat in the water we lost Michelangelo. We did. I don't know. He just decided to go running down there and dive into a tree for reasons that are unknown to me. I wanted to end it like two minutes ago. We could have started with that, but no. Now we have to go out on that note. I'm we have just to hoping to finish the stupid well. That guy's unhappy. Look at him. He's thirsty. Okay. Now it needs architecture. It needs a lot of steps, Joe. I remember that now. I remember somebody telling me that like one of the, the well was one of the most uh, complicated things you could have in Dwarf it Fortress. It was until the instruments came along. It was. God, son of a. <sighs> is your is your other little downward thing designated as a one? Your test. Give that a give that a one so they do it since you're so excited. <laughs> I don't know if I'm excited. It's more of a Stockholm syndrome thing at this point. It's blinking. Someone's going to go traipse into that water and hit that and probably get flushed out into the magma because of the force of the water coming out. How does water pressure work? It's only like ankle ankle deep, knee deep. Three? I mean, three out of seven. Seven is the top. That's like waist deep. Seven's, seven's your ceiling right now. I always imagine four is waist deep. Four would three be has got to be like five Three and deep. a half is halfway, halfway to your ceiling. Yeah, but it's two out of three. It's two and three, so it's like in between that. Okay, so it's been, okay. It's not that bad. It, no, it's like chest. I mean, you're taller than I am, but oh, here he goes. It depends how deep your ceilings are. What? I don't know. He's gone. Is he oh, gone? There he is. I don't know. I think he's fighting the flow. <laughs> All right, go down one more level. Let's see what it did. Is that it? Yay! Yeah, it did. Woo! It's gonna work. <laughs> and we killed Michelangelo. <laughs> I don't know what this, this guy's just hanging out. Oh, he's drinking because he's so thirsty because you can't get that well finished. Yeah, yep, yeah, that's yep. Yeah. The well is finished. This is amazing. Oh, for the love, it can make it a meteor. <laughs> I could stand there and look at Michelangelo's dead corpse in a tree and hang out. <laughs> Can they get to him? You really should probably have them... I mean, because people are going to see him a lot and they're going to be it's unhappy. Good. Make him and make him strong. Strong like a bull. <laughs> make him no, an example. Right. We, can, we can dive into that next time. I got the well finished. We did our test block. It's time to wrap this up. Thanks for listening, guys. And watching. <laughs> If what you aren't happened? already, like and subscribe uh, to our like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. We have this, and we have lots of other cool uh, gameplay videos and a podcast that you can watch and or listen to. If only listening is what you want to do, you can do that. Game of uh, Thrones recaps. You can get our Dwarf Fortress T-shirt. Throw, uh, throw a graphic oh, yeah. up of the Dwarf Fortress T-shirt right here, Joe. Done. I demand it. Boom! There it is. It's up on the screen. I assume. Uh, and uh, I helped design that, so <laughs> I'm pretty proud of that. I didn't help kill Michelangelo. That was all Joe. <laughs> that was all Michelangelo. But, you know, the, the Reacher movie's coming to a theater near you pretty soon. He's sexually attracted to death. I can't help it. <laughs> the Reacher? I'm not going to get into his sexual uh, <laughs> no, sexual inclinations. <laughs> We're just going to have him be creepy and in the water. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. Thanks, guys. See you Bye. next week. I was going to make a dirt block that it was exactly 64 by 64 by 64. Oh, whoa! Okay, I'm leaving the dirt block now. I underestimated how many dirt blocks it would take to fill this project in. <laughs> oh, I'm stuck in the box! Seriously. I'm stuck in the box! Ah! I'm stuck in the box! <laughs> we just decided we were going to make a Let's Play out of it.